Too bad off, but I can't because there's body in the way. I'm low on stamina. Alright, do, do that. God dang it. This is, this is going to be annoying. Yep, here they come. Shock zombie might actually zap me while I'm trying to pick my crap up. Not good. Hmm. I think what I'll do... We'll lead them down this way to get as far away from the shock zombie as we can. So he doesn't hear me killing him. Got guys in the area. Where is Mr. Shock Zombie? He's the only one I really care about. Actually, let's do this. Up upstairs, get my stamina back, switch out my footwear. Tempted to get the rifle in my hands instead of the. I think I think we're okay now. Yeah, we're clear. All right. He must not have wandered in with the other guys. Cool. All right. So, yay. That place is done. Um, check the dojo real quick. <clears throat> what truck? Empty SWAT truck. <laughs> style dojo again. CQB. Damn it! Game! <laughs> Keep stop ripping me off. Hey, fit a judo gi. So, if you've got a dojo nearby and you're really early game, I like the fitted uh, judo gi. And I can't point to stuff, but uh, for only five encumbrance, you get 3-3 three, three protection. For torso, arms, and legs, that's actually a pretty good trade-off. And 95% coverage was really good. So, don't pass up the judo gi. Fit a judo gi, preferably. Alright, <clears throat> so another dojo let down. And now we're down to the welding cart, the SWAT truck, and the subway. And I am overweight already. So I gotta be careful. So if I try to drag the welding cart out of here, it is 1.30 now. Be quite the trip. Shouldn't be a problem at night though. But I'd be leaving the vehicle behind essentially. And I haven't checked the subway yet. But we picked up some really, really good magic books. That would help us tremendously for staying alive. Cure light wounds or grotesque enhancement, either way, will uh, help. Now what I don't have is I don't have any of the um, mana mutations. So I'm going to have a very limited mana pool. I got a pretty good intelligence, but um, compared to having the, uh, the mana bump from the mutations <clears throat> or traits, um, the mana pool is going to be pretty, pretty tight for usage. I think I need to get back to the base with... So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go grab the welding cart. We'll drag it over to the SWAT truck. Check it out if we can. Then we're going <clears> to <throat> we're gonna head south with the welding cart. See if we can get it back down towards our base. And if we have enough time, we'll come back. But um, I got too much stuff that's going to be really, really important to get back. So that's the plan. So I need to go... Down a block and over. Hmm. 
Mm, not liking this arrangement. I'm right on the nameplate. <laughs> um, and another dojo I'd actually like to pop into. Er, yeah, that's what I was afraid of. Right in there, and now I've closed that gap north of me. Oh, crap. Alright, let's go that way. Cool. Good guess. Station positioning. Alright, dojo number three on the disappointment train. <laughs> what have you got for me? Love the way that guy just went running right for the door to block me. He's <laughs> just randomly breaking shit. Uh, knock me down. Nothing again? Jesus. So much disappoint. What's that, like four or five dojos we've been to so far? back home. 73 when I'm dragging it. That's still plenty fast, so I need to go east to check the SWAT truck. Local shock zombies hang... Whoop, 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 whoop! Here's that bullshit again! <laughs> uh, damn shock zombies! Well, swipe so truck's getting a little, um, a little beat up. It's even drivable. No, it's not drivable. No battery. Three of the seats have stuff possible. Hmm. I'm going to be heading east from here. Let's... Leave this here for a minute. See if we can pull these guys. Actually, I want to pull them north, if anywhere. Never mind, we'll go in that way. Oh, I already been in this one. Ah, <laughs> down me twice. Alright, all praise the new armor and the uh, dodge ability. Um, ah, pawn shop. Alright, we'll check out this pawn shop on our way southward. Or we won't, with a shock zombie sitting right outside. Alright, so next east, next street, just follow it south, 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 and then a few more south. <clears throat> hey, kitty cat. Alright, good old drizzle cut down my vision range again. <clears throat> now it's pretty much just a whole lot of go south. Stay in the middle of the road, see if we can catch sight of any useful vehicles. Whoops. <laughs> My bad. Got a grab on me and didn't want to let go. Hey, leave my welding rig alone. Of five five six. Uh, that I do want. Leave that there. See if I can kill him before he knocks me down. <laughs> I got him for forty eight, but he still knocked me down. Then knocked me down. 
Uh, whoops, I think it dropped it on the ground. It's because I'm overweight. <clears throat> it auto drops stuff when you're overweight. You gotta be careful about that. Okay, we're making progress. Pretty soon we'll be able to just be able to fast move our way down the road. Yeah, it's just safe mode on and start booking. Whoops. Alright. Uh, I think I might just leave this somewhere, maybe even right here. Time is at 140. Nah, I, I can easily make the trip. Let's do this. So, safe mode is on. Map, take me to here, please. <laughs> God damn, zombie. How did you end up directly behind me, zombie, with auto move like this? How, how does that happen? Cannot reach that destination. You made it to here, but you can't make it. All right, whatever. <laughs> you say so. We'll do it the old fashioned way. All right, take off blades, wear boots, map. And now all of a sudden I can't reach the destination again. I don't know what's going on with it. Yeah, whatever game. We'll just do it this way. Alright, we made it. We have a welding rig. <clears throat> or a welding cart. <laughs> no way for me to grab that and put it up there. That's fine. So we got the engine crane and we've got the welding rig or the welding cart. So we're pretty much all set. Uh, if I do want to get any work done on the vehicles, um, we got the skill I need. We got the tools. I've got the uh, solar car with all the power that we left behind, unfortunately. So that's about the only downside. It's only 158, so I still got time. So let's go ahead and uh, head on back. All right. <coughs> Excuse me. So, don't care about that note. Got rid of that. Um, I think that's all the all the notes that I had made.
Oh. <clears throat> yeah, not the first time. It's this cough I've got. I constantly have to mute the mic to uh, prevent me from coughing you guys out of your chairs. And uh, I always forget to <laughs> flip it back on. I've got a running bet with myself how many times I'll forget to uh, flip the mute back over each night with this cough I've got. Good thing is, a couple more days, I'll finally be over this stupid congestion. All right, so 2 to 14. Is that going to be enough time to get done what I want to get done? Man, we have got a ton of good stuff. I think at a minimum, I want to at least go get my solar car back. Maybe grab the M2 off of that while I'm there. Toss it into the trunk of the SUV and drive back. Then we'll spend another couple of days learning some spells and seeing just how useful I can make them with my limited mana supply. But I really need to get into some labs. I can't make serum without the uh, three tools for uh, mutagen making now. <coughs> Research facility is the primary place to get those, which is a pain in the ass when I can't find one. But uh, supposedly the little labs have them now, so I want to get into a little lab. So we're, we, we've got to get into mm, some sewers. Maybe we'll do some, we'll get the car, we'll do some training. Then we'll come down and we'll hit this town. I'll, I'll clear out the two doctor's offices and we'll pop down into one of these sewer subway stations and we'll see if we can find a uh, small lab we can work our way into. <clears throat> That's currently my plan. I'm not sure. I, I might get unlucky at some point and just acid discharge have a bad series both while I'm awake and then again while, I, while I'm asleep and kill myself so I don't want to let this go too too long uh faster to rollerblade over there I'm not sure it would be but it would guarantee my safety a lot better Come on, keyboard. <clears throat> I don't know what you're doing, game. Oops. Okay. Let's go north. Two more blocks. And we'll cut west. <clears throat> Too, too populated for safe mode now. <laughs> I have to do a lot of key pressing. Mm, nope. Alright. Tire shop. Oh, that's the M2 with ammo also. Um... All right, we'll, we'll take a look at it when we get over there. <laughs> Another miracle grab by a crawling zombie. <clears throat> was that a decayed? I think that was a decayed.
Diesel, battery, wheels, no security system. Hmm. Oh, we have a drivable luxury RV, huh? Well, that's tempting. Completely clean and full storage battery to go with it. Dang it, game. <laughs> <clears throat> and an easy straight east and then straight south to get out of here. How many more vehicles do I actually need down there, though? Technically, with the SUV, I've already got all of my power needs met. But that also would have all of the other <clears throat> accoutrement or uh, kitchen unit and all that stuff. I need to track down a mobile meth lab, too. Or get lucky and find a chemistry set down in one of the uh, labs. Well, let's see. Um, nah, it's... Nah. I don't know about the eight ball on this one. Hey there, Shoyer. <laughs> Thanks much for the resub. Uh, Alright, Magic Eight Ball, should we uh should we jump in this thing and try to drive this home? <sighs> damn it. Uh damn you, Magic Eight Ball. <clears throat> See how far we get on the two leaders. I need to go one more block and then straight south until we <laughs> I ripped off both wing mirrors almost simultaneously. <laughs> uh, oh crap! Not sure I can make it through that gap. I don't care what condition it arrives in. <laughs> All I want it for is that storage battery and uh, the uh, various tools and stuff. Even just getting it out of the city would be pretty much a victory, which we're already almost there. How many times am I going to have to make this trip on foot, though? <clears throat> eh, I'm going to turn the headlights on now. Oops. Whoops. <laughs> Hitting boulders with a, a luxury RV. Not recommended behavior. Alright, let's just park this thing right here for now, I guess. <clears throat> uh, yeah, you can turn the fridge off. Alright, so we did a little front end damage. Nothing too bad. We got the main parts that I wanted out. We got the menu. Oh, they broke the washing machine. <laughs> Guess I should have checked before I took off to make sure it actually had the stuff I cared about. Kitchen unit, mini fridge, washing machine is busted, which, eh, that's fine. But we got leather seats that we can take apart for uh, leather components. That's the other reason. And, of course, the perfect condition clean storage battery. All right. Well... <laughs> Here we go again. Still only 240. I took, what, half an hour to get up there, get that, and come back? I think this time I am going to go just across the field. Ah, 
Yeah. <laughs> it's getting a little, a little hairier. Ah, good old schizophrenia. My perception. Alright, yay, that was much faster. We're back at the vehicle. So we'll go up and check that uh SPH. Yeah. Hey you guys. Over this way. Yes, big dangerous guy over here. Come get me. And get away from my vehicle. <clears throat> Alright, problem here is I'm not going to be able to take much apart because of the zombie population. I'd love to grab the Browning and that uh, belt of ammo. We'll at least do that. Take the diesel can or diesel. Jerry can of diesel, 150 spare rounds, unload, pick it up, We're massively overweight. Hmm. <laughs> Willow bark. I think I can still make it even with the being overweight. I just need to get around this one group that I relocated earlier. Yeah, we'll be fine. All right, 320. Um, we make it back with this. I'm pretty satisfied with the trip. One of the big questions with this lab is, am I geared up enough that... The man hacks won't be able to just shred me. I think I might have enough cut protection now that they don't worry me nearly as much. But we'll, um, we'll not worry about that right now. All right, um, headlights on. All right, back home we go. It's a good trip. We got a lot, uh, a lot looted. Cleared a lot of my notes. Got a bunch of really important gear back to the base. Not the least of which was that welding cart to finish off all my tool needs. With the uh, luxury RV and this SUV, we have all the power we might need. So, do I just put a vehicle together? skip the entire metalworking process make my life a little easier whoops especially if I can get uh, like the SWAT truck modified rather have my beloved Humvee of course but we haven't run across a convenient one I can drive out with oh crap I 
Unfortunately for this run, I'm not going to be able to do the uh, motorcycle. <laughs> That's probably where I rammed into that boulder with the, uh, the Lux RV. <laughs> we blew out a seat, did we? Or with some vehicle. Alright, so yeah, we've got the military cargo truck, we got the SWAT truck, we got the Lux RV, we've got the sports car, and we've got our handy dandy little electric SUV. Quite the menagerie of vehicles way down here in this out of the way LMOE shelter. <laughs> Just map back in so my OCD doesn't bug me. Keep the batteries. Don't have any particular need for that. Keep all of that except for there. All right, I think we're back in good shape. <clears throat> I think we only got what hit once by that one guy. <clears throat> got knocked out a bunch of times, but uh, our protection uh, saved the day. Let's grab up. Okay, check that first. So that gets me three to six. I think that fills that gap I was missing, right? Yeah, that fills that gap. Cool. I'm not sure. I think I think amateur radio goes all the way to electronics eight. So I think we've got all the books for electronics all the way to the top. So the only thing I'm missing to finish out my skills is what? The final final first aid book, final computer book. And that's it. Might be close to it. Hmm. Okay. Uh, more pine nuts. More pine needle tea. And I need to read at least... I gotta make some decisions here. Problem I'm gonna run into now is I don't remember all of the all of the magic book and uh, uh, class combinations. So, if I get the bow, that's going to be Druid, which locks me out of Biomancer. I think what I want is Technomancer Biomancer. So that means I would have to do without the bow, which uh, I'm okay with. We're, we're coming across enough ammo. It's not super critical. It's very, very handy, especially if you can get it early game. But by this point, I'm not as worried about it. So I think I am going to go Biomancer, Technomancer, what? Kelvinist Magus? 
Yeah, I, I hate Animus, so... Filemancer, Technomancer, Kelvinus, Magus. So we're going to spend some time doing some uh, magic book reading, which I've already got. So I activate a few things here. Love losing on the first attempt. Alright, so focus is fine. Focus actually doesn't have anything to do with uh, the magic books. I shouldn't have bothered. Um, excuse me? Oh, that's right. Gotta activate them. Alright, so... We're gonna avoid the book of trees. Home of Flesh. Grotesque Enhancement. So this one I like because it uh, increases your strength and physical abilities and gives you a little bit of healing. So you get kind of a, a double bonus as opposed to just the Cure Light Wounds. Um, hundred fifty Versus... Your light wounds. Oof, 800. Holy crap. I'm not sure I'm even going to have 800. So, Biomaster, Classless, Technomaster. So, I can study all three of these safely. Ah, animist. Technomancer's fine. Eh. Nope, nope, nope. <laughs> so only manatricity out of this one. And that'll go mana for bionics. Which I don't have a lot of but good bionics. Or any good bionics, really, at this point. So eventually this will be useful. But that's not a critical one for now. Um, so yeah. This is all pure Biomancer. <clears throat> and another mix. So Kelvinus would be okay, Magus would be okay, and Biomancer would be okay. So yeah, these would be all okay. Alright, so we got multiple ones that will work. Um, eight hundred. Damn, I don't remember it. I, I, I don't remember it being that much. <laughs> that better be a lot of healing for eight hundred. Uh, yeah. Let's learn the one with the grotesque first. Uh, Tome of Flesh. All right, Biomancer. Yes. Okay, next up. I'm going to wait on most of the rest of this. Gravity well to level up my spell casting. Um, Uh, 
All right, so that's two of them locked in. Technomancer, Biomancer. So we still got Kelvinist and Magus to go. It'll take me forever to get that one. <laughs> Good old scratching. I love it when scratching prevents me from learning things. <laughs> oh, it's going to be this again. All right, so we got Kelvinist done. I'm answer Kelvinist. Technomancer went where? There it is. Alright, so just the Magus left. I don't think I'm going to manage to get the Magus learned. This one's going to take so long, it's going to get interrupted so many times. We'll give it a couple of tries. <clears throat> Depending on how many times I get irritated here. Ah, I ran out of light. Forgot about that problem. Yep. I can't remember if this, um... If it saves the progress or not. Yeah, but it's just gonna drive me nuts. Wasted time, wasted time, wasted time. There we got it. Cool. Okay, we're locked. We can't uh we can't accidentally read something. Even with the messages, it's not Likely, but uh, still. Technomancer, Magus, Calvinist, and Biomancer. That's what we're going with. <clears throat> and we've got a few spells lined up and ready. I just need to level up my uh, spell crafting so we can cast them reliably. Grotesque Enhancement, probably the one I want the most right now. Give us the uh, the bonus with the, uh, the healing included. So, 1,300 mana. Yeah, that's not a lot. <laughs> Max mana, 1,500. That's not a lot. Like I said, that one Cure Light's 800. One casting of that. So the Grotesque is, uh, how much? Doesn't, oh, 400? Yeah, that's, that's, that's a lot. All right, well, we'll see what we can get done with it. It'll help. <clears throat> and we're tired. Time to do some more pine needles. Um... Turn that off, turn that off. I think it's time to make some more bandages. Actually, while well, we've got it, let's go uh, more pine nuts. <laughs> acid spray, acid spray. Oh, we ran out of pine nuts. Not good. It's not going to last nearly long enough.
All right, off to bed we go. <clears throat> Come on, one more decent sleep. Give us one more pulse of healing, please. Come on, you can do it. I think that's all I'm going to get out of this one. Didn't get back to where I wanted to be, unfortunately. <clears throat> Alright, so let's see. Let's focus on getting our spellcraft up so we can use that spell as we uh, have ability. Uh, is it possible to set up a real generator in your base or only car related stuff? I'm not sure what you mean by a real generator that's not all also car related stuff. Pretty much all machinery in the game is car related stuff. There's no such thing as any kind of working electricity based machinery that's not car related stuff. <clears throat> there are separate generators. You can actually find portable generators in the game world, but it's just a single tile vehicle with... Uh, an engine and a gas tank and alternator and so on to uh, generate the electricity. All right, uh, back to the pine nut shuffle. Stuff disappears way too fast. And yeah, we're just gonna oops, not, not standing next to that pile. Oh my flesh, grotesque. Um long time. Not really gonna be eight hours because I'm gonna get uh hurt and or scratching constantly. <laughs> yep. God, that's gonna be so annoying. Um, yeah, we might not get any skills or any spells at this rate. Spellcraft a one. That's not nearly enough, especially for the amount of time that took. Well, oh, we're out of gas again. We're actually starting to get low on gas. Hmm. Um, yeah, that's actually what I did want to do. <clears throat> yeah, this, uh, this is not going the way I wanted it to. This is way too slow with all the interruptions from the, uh, the scratching. one more time. I, I, I just, the whole scratching interrupting your action and making you press 18 keys again and again and again and again, I just, I detest that kind of mechanic so much in games. Not just Cataclysm. Any game that uses just interrupts that force you to press keys over and over and over and over again. I hate it, I hate it, I hate it. Find some other way of introducing 
some other consequence. Stop making me press eight keys every fucking two seconds. <laughs> I hate it. Or at least put in a continue previous action button so I can hit one damn key and continue things. It's really bad with certain of the menus you have to go through, certain of the actions. And, uh, man, we're tired again. We made very little progress. We made it all the way up to Spellcraft 2. <laughs> Not good. We were burning light like crazy all of a sudden. I blow through books way faster than I'm making any progress on these spells. We might have to... I was really hoping to get the spells to be helpful, but I I don't know at this point. 57% fail chance with current he, uh, things that cause problems, which is gloves, mobility, somatic, and so on. So This would be something I would generally cast in a safe position, so the fail chance wouldn't bother me. I still continue to say that I think the um, casting cost should be deducted even on fails. Even if it's just like half or a quarter or some portion, I don't think you should be able to just recast a hundred times <laughs> when you've got a 99% fail rate to get a spell to go off. Seems weird to me. Let's see what kind of healing we get out of it though. Uh, oh yeah, uh, activate backpack. There we go. Look at that healing! <laughs> okay, there we go. Got some experience. Our wounds closed up. My body is now rippling. We've got strength decks and perception bonuses. That's why I went for that particular spell. I think that's enough to keep me alive. I think that all by itself. So it might be good to get one, maybe two more levels in it. But even at this point, with 57%, where I can uh, easily, when I wake up from a particularly bad night, pop myself back up to full health. And I got enough mana to do it one more time. Yeah, 410 mana. So that'll do. Part of this is that <laughs> I mean, it looks impressive, but remember, I've only got 42 hit points, <laughs> so it's not that impressive. A regular character with like 10 strength and not having frail would have uh, like 90 or 100 hit points, and the bars wouldn't move nearly as much. So the bars movements looks impressive, but it's not actually all that damn much health. So yeah, the 13 intelligence I knew would give me enough mana. I was hoping that I'd be able to, to do something with it. Plus, we regen to full mana. I think it's 8 hours you regen to full. So we'll get quite a bit of use out of this. Uh, so is all, any other ones critical? I don't think any of the other ones are super critical. So, mm, Manatricity is the only one left on that list that I could learn. And I'm not using Bionics right now, so that one I'm not worried about. Toma Flesh. Um, good stuff, but level 14. Yeah, that's, that's what I can level up my spellcraft off of. But man, it would be nice to do it without, uh, without the itching. I don't have enough Thorazine to constantly use Thorazine while I'm doing this process, though. Flesh Pouch. Don't really care about more storage space. Acid Spray. Again, it'd be nice. Especially if the AoE works now. I think Korg says he got most of the AoE stuff finally sorted out, so I'm hopeful the AoE stuff works. And Vicious Tentacle. Eh, not too worried about it. So, not worried about that one. Uh, I can only cast Cure Light Wounds once, so it better be really damn powerful. Um, but I, I don't see that being beneficial to me when I can do the Grotesque twice and get stat bonuses and be at full strength for, uh, the same cost. Uh, Blinding Flash, not worried about that either, so I'm done with this one. Oh, actually, Bless might be okay. I'll level up further. Yeah, Bless actually is another good one. Because it gives you energy as well. I'm 
Try and get at least a level or so in less. Tired. That's fine. Give it a try. Here comes the pain. At least now I'm regenning my mana while this is happening, so no matter how much damage I take, we're back to full mana already, so. We can definitely keep ahead of it now. So that one spell all by itself will keep me alive while we get the rest of this done. So that's awesome. Uh, we got it to one, 60% fail chance, that's fine. Excuse me? Build with energy that improves everything you do. All right, that's, that sounds fun. Strength, dex, perception, and most important, speed. Speed plus 20. Is it actually, why, why am I showing do I have something being giving me a negative? So here's another one of those situations where I don't understand the reported numbers. I have no other negatives going on currently. It's supposedly a plus two, <laughs> but I've only got nines. <clears throat> Instead of ten. It would be ten, ten, eleven. And I got nothing negatively affecting my speed, but I'm sitting at 103 when it should be 120 something. Is it tired state? Maybe it's the tired state. And it just doesn't report it. Because the game likes to play that way. Hmm. I got pretty deep into the thirsty status there. Huh, weird. Alright. So yeah, I think I'm going to concentrate on just those two right now. I'm going to need to save my mana, I think, for those more than having ability to do a point flare gravity well right now. If anything, I'd rather have the uh, Bone Spear to level up off of. 350 to cast. Yeah, Bone Spear be the other one I do. So we'll do um, maybe in one more level of Grotesque, a couple levels of Bless, and then from then on, whatever I have opportunity, we'll level up off of Bone Spear to also raise up our spellcrafting skill. <clears throat> All right, so I'm not worried about damage anymore, so that's awesome. Um... We're still going to have a really hard time sleeping. Like I said, at least now, I don't really care about the damage levels. So we'll just keep... Sleep, 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 sleep! <clears throat> yeah, that was a good acid splash. <laughs> 